Happy Sunday, y'all. Happy Sunday. And welcome back to another vlog. So listen, I said I wasn't going to vlog today. Because I was just trying to get myself set up for the week. And get myself going, y'all. Let me tell you something. I woke up with a burst of energy. I can always tell when my cycle comes. And when it leaves, when it le when it comes, I start to feel a little bit better, a little bit better because those two weeks, let me tell you something. Most people's luteal phase lasts like you have two sections of, you have two phases of your luteal phase. So you have the first phase, which is, you know, you're pretty much just coming into your body preparing to the whole time your body's preparing to have a cycle. But that first set, you still might be able to do some things or, you know, something like that. If you have PMDD, it makes it extremely harder. The second phase of that cycle, y'all, let me tell you something. When I tell you I was shut down for two weeks, y'all could tell how my energy was and wasn't. I don't know if you could tell, but I could definitely tell how my energy was up, down, up, down. Not even up. I'm going to say a little elevated than before and down. Some days I ain't even have like I didn't have it. I told y'all in the last vlog, I was like, I have worked out for two days. Typically that's not me. Like I go three to four because I train heavy. Like I my weights are heavy, but cardio is like daily. The last two weeks I couldn't do nothing. So when my cycle came on, like the first couple of days, I felt better but still bad. And then the third day I started to come out of it. So today I'm just like, whoo, praise Jesus. So today I woke up with a lot of energy. And so I was like, I'm going to, I have been talking about, you know, changing my office up to like from a actual like office office to an actual beauty room. And it's kind of that now. I just don't have furniture in here. I think I told y'all the last time I was going to put a sofa in here, like maybe a love seat or either a couple chairs or something. But I have two desks that are in here. So I just took one of the desks is still back here. It's right here. But I took the other one I have you sitting up on right now and I just moved it over down a little bit because I'm going to get a vanity mirror to go here. That way I can sit in here and do my makeup. Um, and then, you know, like I can post, you know, if I need to show y'all something, I can post it in here. Um, I can post it from my office slash studio space in here. Um, if I need to show something I'm wearing or make my videos for, um, my socials or whatever, I can do it in, from in, like what I'm wearing. I can do it from in here or talking or whatever, but I think it's going to work out well. Now I just have to go on the hunt for some furniture pieces and I am very, I'm not indecisive when it comes to furniture because I know what I want. And I know what I like, but I am very, I take my time. Okay. I don't be in no rush to pick up nothing. I take my time. So it's going to be when I find something that I absolutely love and I don't mind paying, you know, anything for it. So to speak, I'm not going to pay something for nothing, but I don't mind paying for what it is that I want. But I am going to take my time and find what it is I want to find because I know what I the look that I want. Y'all see my pictures back up here, right? Y'all see the photos. I keep picking them up, taking them, taking them down, putting them back up, taking them down, putting them back up. One because they're in the way. So I was like, let me just put them pictures back up. I am going to change the artwork that's in there, probably to something just black and white. Um, to just keep, you know, I'm kind of probably gonna move the pink out of here. So right now I have pink curtains in here, really light blush, but I'm going to take those down. They're going to come out too, but I know the look that I'm going for in here. So that's just what we're going to do. So in the meantime, we're just going to, we're just decluttering. I'm in like a declutter space. So I kind of, I moved, I had a file cabinet in here under my desk. I cleaned everything out of it and threw the, uh, threw the file cabinet out. I threw so much stuff out. Like I had so many things that was in there that I was not using. I got rid of it. The next thing I'm going to tackle this week is the closet. It's a mess, but it's got to be done. So I'm going to tackle it and get rid of a whole, probably 80% of that stuff that's in there. Get rid of it. And then I'm going to tackle my closet in my bedroom. And it just needs the winter clothes just need to come down. Um, yeah, the winter clothes need to come down. My spring and all the things that I've shown you all that I've bought, plus the other things that I have need to go up. And everything needs to be like color-coded and um, just 
organized a little bit better. So that's the goal this week to declutter and organize these two spaces. But I just wanted to pop in, start the vlog off and say, hey, and happy Sunday. I am, what time is it? I don't know, watch on my phone. I think it's, oh, it's 11 o'clock. It's 11.24, so I'm going to call it a night. I'm going to go wash my face and go on about my business and, yeah. <laughs> So happy Monday. So we're in the car and we're headed to training. So before I go in though, I need to go in Michael's, um, TJ Maxx and Joanne's because we're hosting brunch this um, Sunday, Easter Sunday. So we're hosting brunch at our home and I need to see what I can find because I got some bunnies, but I want some more. And I waited till the week of Easter to find them. So we're gonna run in um, TJ, I mean, not TJ Maxx. We're gonna run in Joann's really quickly and Michael's and TJ Maxx and see what we can find. So let's run in here. So y'all, here's a purple one. Should I really get that big green button? I feel like I might. Let me see how much it's raining. Back. Cause my baby needs this bunny. Let's see. I didn't even have time to record in Joann's because I saw what I needed immediately. I didn't even have time to whip the camera out. But, and because I'm a little bit late to training. So just a teeny, like a couple minutes. So I found what I was looking for. So I'll show you all what I got when I got home. Um, I had, y'all saw the spring where I had some bunnies and um, I had some bunnies, but I wanted a few more. So I found what I was looking for, so to speak. Um, but yeah, we're headed to training. I'm headed to training now. So I'm going to talk to y'all when I come out. After I go to training, of course, I'm going to the sauna. So I will talk to you all, I guess, maybe when I come out of training or either when I get home. Happy Wednesday. Happy Wednesday, y'all. So, I am headed into training. Listen to me. When I tell y'all 
I my stomach is in shambles this morning. I ate gluten last night. First of all, I ate Texas Roadhouse, and I don't typically eat Texas Roadhouse. I thought I'd be all right because I had salmon, right? I had salmon and a sweet potato. No, y'all know I can't eat gluten. I'm not supposed to have gluten, right? Because I got a condition. And <laughs> I ate a piece of bread. I actually ate two pieces of bread. So that's on me. But I'm not feeling my best. But I was like, I need to get up and get to training this morning. So here I am. Here's the thing about training in the mornings. I am not a morning person anymore. Well, let me not say that. I, I love mornings. I am the, a morning person, but I've never been the kind of person that likes to talk in the mornings. That's not me. Like, let's be quiet and let's wait till we all warm up at about 10 and then we can talk a little bit, not a lot. But people just be wanting to chat in the morning. Like, I don't understand what's so much to talk about in the mornings when we're working out. Be quiet. Anyway, I'm about to go in here uh, with my coaches. Chatty morning group. Maybe they be chatty. I'm about to go in here. And then when I come out, I'm going to the sauna to detox my system because I it's necessary today. Then after that, I'm headed home because I got some packages coming. And I want to... Um, got some packages coming and I want to show you what I got so we're gonna try them on together I did order a dress from the Target collab that just dropped I'm a little nervous about the dress because I wanted it really bad like before the collection dropped I was on the site like a week before looking at what I wanted I knew I wanted this dress because orange is my favorite color but I already know based on the sizing of the model I already know the dress is gonna be too long so I know I'm gonna have to take it to get it altered but I just hope it's not too big because when I buy knits, I tend to size down because you know they stretch out. So I typically wear a small, but I feel like in this knit, I might need an extra small, but I ordered a small. I don't know, I don't know. But I just want to be safe because I was like, I can always get it taken in if necessary. Um, but we'll see when we get home and I ordered a couple of other dresses from Target so I don't know if my express order is coming today but I don't know but we'll see but let me go in here because I'm procrastinating talking to y'all let me run in here and get this workout in it's back bicep and shoulder day so yeah let's go get this work and then I'll be I'll chat with y'all when I get home can y'all hear that I know you can see it can y'all hear that right like it's actually slim down since I first got in the car. It's pouring. I'm like, now Lord, I am a super advocate for the stay in your house ministries. And you got me outside in this rain. <laughs> okay. So we are, I just had to show y'all how hard it was raining out here. Like it's pouring. So, and this today I want to go do the thing before to the sauna. And I'm going home. I'll see y'all at the house. I keep saying I'm going to see y'all at the house. But I keep seeing y'all in the car. So, I left my sauna appointment. I came back in here. It's not raining as hard as it was, but it's still raining. I get my hair done tomorrow, so I'm glad about that. I'm glad I don't have to go anywhere on Black Friday. I mean, Lord Jesus. Sorry, Lord. Good Friday. Because I got things to do at the house because I told y'all that we were hosting. I told y'all we were hosting brunch for our, my husband's family on Sunday. So I got stuff to get together. Yesterday, I decided I wanted to clean and declutter my entire office closet and it was a mess i think i threw all the things away i'm gonna throw away got all the stuff away 
got all the stuff out that I'm taking to donate. But I got to figure out a way to put all that stuff back in there. So anyway, I just left the sauna. So I went to the bakery. And I got a matcha and strawberry matcha scone. It's gluten free. Now they stones typically are good. But I was scared about this matcha. Because I don't want it to have me hyped up. It's good. Actually, really good. And let me show you what I bought Jordan. She loves their cinnamon rolls. So I got her a cinnamon roll. I know my husband's going to be like, why didn't you buy me one? You can get one on Friday. You can get one on Friday. You don't need a cinnamon roll. Huh. Mm -mm. But I'm going to eat this scone. And I'm really going to see y'all when I get home. I don't want to feel the top I love. But this bottom, it's got pockets. But this bottom, this length, y'all, I'm only 5'3". Okay? So... The long, I, I, I don't know, this, this particular length, I know it's maxi style, but I just, I'm not sure. And then, I, I don't know. I'm going to ask my daughters, they're going to always give me the real. Might be taking it back though, because they'll hurt your feelings. Okay, they'll keep you humble. But I mean, it's cute. It's just. I know it's supposed to look like a top and a skirt. Two separate pieces. I like it, but I just don't know about this. If this is necessarily my vibe. I don't know. I'll get back with you. I'm downstairs. I did not feel like going upstairs in my office. So let me show y'all this dress. I'm standing on the steps and show y'all. Because y'all know I'm short. Me. I think it's cute. I even like the length of it. Like, it's so cute. It's so cute. So, I love the length. I love the material. Um, I love this little peekaboo thigh right here. So, if y'all didn't know, orange is my favorite color, right? Orange is my favorite color. I love orange. I love like a, y'all know I love this. I told y'all in the last vlog, I love dresses and tops that go in like this. But I like it. I thought I would have to get it altered, but I think I actually like the length on this. I actually like the length on this one. And plus I feel like because it wraps, let me go back up the steps. Because it's a wrap dress, it almost needs to be this length. Like, I feel like if I got it altered shorter, it wouldn't do well. But I got some cute white shoes that I would wear with it. Let me go get them. So these are the shoes. <laughs> Y'all know Gianni Benny is one of my favorite designers when it comes to like shoes. These are the shoes. So let me put these on. See if I can give y'all a full effect. I got these shoes like, I think like two years ago. I'm gonna have to get up on the steps so y'all can see. Can y'all see it? I don't even know what it looked like on the thing. I just, it's so quick to show y'all. Let me see. That's cute. And then I just have to accessorize it right. Typically, I don't like dresses this length because no. I think I still probably could have taken the extra small because I do have a little bit of bunch of fabric, a little bit of bunch in here. But I think because it's knit, I can get away with it. Um, but this is adorable. Like this is so stinking cute.
Yeah. I think I like it. I like the length. I don't have no bra on, so excuse that. But I definitely will wear a bra with this because I'm not I'm not one of them girls. I don't I don't even though I'm not of the big boob committee. I still feel like I need a little something else. So I'll probably wear a good strapless with this. But I think it's cute, y'all. I love it. So this is I'm gonna keep it. Yeah, I'm gonna keep it. I was I was worried about this length. I was worried about the length. But I think we can do it. It is a little long for my taste, but because it has the opening in the front, I think we could get away with it. Yeah. I've been gone. If you see the mess behind me, I told y'all I was decluttering my office. So just ignore it because I got a lot going on. Show y'all stuff I picked up from Home Goods. Y'all. So I told y'all we hosting brunch over here and I want to do like a springy type theme where I'm using greenery, boxwood greenery and I have these boxwood greenery placemats in my stash for spring stuff and so I want to bring those out and I, I'm going to set up my table i'm gonna set up my table that is in my dining room i'm gonna set that up for people to eat at but i'm also going to do like a setup like i did for galentine's day i'm gonna do one for spring and so i wanted these on my little buffet bar or whatever you know it's gonna be so i picked this one up this is the medium size y'all look at how cute they are and i thought it was so good because look at the texture on this and it was only $14.99. So I got the medium size. It's like the medium size one. And I also picked up the bigger one. So the bigger one was the bigger one was $19.99, but they gave it to me. They took some money off because it has, you know, some of the greenery missing right here. But it's fine. I can turn this back this way and you know nobody will ever know. So this one is so let me keep both of them like that's so good but this one was $19.99 and I thought that was such a steal for it to be in this kind of vase and it to be boxwood like greenery I thought it was too good then y'all ready Look, scalloped glassware, y'all. Is this not like screaming spring? Look at this. It's so cute. Like, it's pink. It's so cute. The, hold, hold on, sick pen in. Let me get back to the cute. It's so cute, right? So I almost went, when it comes to a glass, I'm gonna have it, okay? I almost went a little overboard because they had so many different beautiful colored glassware items. But to me, this one looked the best and it will hold the most. So, you know, if we want to drink tea or water or juice or some kind of punch or whatever, we can stick it in here. Now, I bought six of these and I saw some of my husband's family today and they were like, we're just coming over to the house and we'll bring something. I was like, oh, I don't have enough glassware for them, but we just... We just gonna it's just about the it's just about the setup. It's just like setup. Okay. I got other glasses y'all can drink out of. But those are so pretty. They had like this really pretty purple, but it was like a coupe glass. It wasn't um it wasn't like a regular drinking glass. So but anyway, anyway, I got those glasses. They were four ninety nine a piece. That was all I picked up from Home Goods, Michaels. The purple bunny that y'all saw me pick up broke, the ear broke off in my hand as I was going to the register. So I got up to the front and I said, how much can you give me this for? She was like, I can give it to you for $4. Great, I'll take it. So I bought it and I brought it home and I'm gonna glue it back together. But I did pick this one up. I 
sure y'all like Nicole. But hear me out. My, I'm an auntie, right? Y'all know I'm an auntie. I'm a great aunt. I'm a great aunt. And my niece is coming over here to do her photo shoot because we have a backdrop. I told her, I said, well, I can make a backdrop and, you know, this little stuff. So she got to have props for her backdrop. Even though she probably, the bunny is taller than she is. But that's not the point. The point is, this bunny matches with the other bunnies that I have. So it's going to be cute. And I'll show y'all because I think I'm probably going to try to set it up and see what it looks like tomorrow. Um... Yeah, I started working on some of the trees that are going to anchor the backdrop tonight. I started working on those um, tonight a little bit. But I'll show y'all the whole setup. But that was all I picked up. I did pick up something from Joanne's. But I got to go get it. Hang on. I found the bunny. <laughs> Look at that. I was so mad. But I really wanted it because it was the only one that they had, right? So, it'll get right back. It'll. Just like new. So, all I have to do is just hot glue it on there. So, I'll probably do that in a few minutes. But, from Joanne. Joanne's had these little, um, these little greenery bunnies. That you can never find. And they were 70% off. These are so cute. I was like again. This is what you get for picking up bunnies. The week of Easter. But I found some. This is all I needed was something small like this. And I also got that one. I think this one was originally $14.99. I think I paid like $3 for it. And then. Hold on I can tell you. I paid $4.50 for the bigger one, and these were $3. So these are so cute. They only had one of these, so I picked up one of these and two of these because that's all I need because this combined with, let me see if y'all see the vision. Combined with these, and it's, y'all get, y'all get the vision. See where I'm going with it. And I also have cream downstairs if I need it. But I kind of wanted to do blues and purple and mint green. But I will make it work. But I thought these were so cute. And then I think that's all I got. These things shed like crazy. I got flop stuff all over my pants. But that's what I picked up, y'all. That's what I picked up. And so... Tonight, I'm going to finish working on my office, finish getting all this stuff. Yeah. Y'all driving? Unfortunately. Do you, um, do you have to get over Anyway. Stuff? But girl, I'm going to talk to y'all when I finish this closet. Or maybe even tomorrow. therapist about to get a massage <laughs> and after that I have to go straight to get a wax so I'm gonna be talking to y'all once I come out of this space Bye. when I tell y'all I'm not gonna ever not be waxed again not ever again okay because it's just the best like and this time it did not hurt 
as bad as the first the first time i was just like oh my god but i told y'all i was going back so this is my second time being back and i love it so it did not hurt as bad neither did it take as long so i'm getting ready to go find out where my husband is so we can do a little shopping um because y'all know that like again we having brunch on sunday so they said something about maybe i'm just a bougie Maybe I'm just a little bit, you know, bougie. Because they said something about chicken and waffles. And I'm like, that's not what I had in mind. Like, I had in mind, like, bacon, eggs. You know, just like bacon, eggs. Um, maybe French toast or waffles. Um, like, maybe some kind of salmon something or something. Girl, I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'm the problem. Maybe it's me. But... I'm vlogging on my phone right now. I'm going to pull my camera out in just a second. And I think when we're out and about, I'm just going to have my camera on with me. So I think we're going to go to Costco. Um, I'm really hoping Costco has some like purple roses. Because I did, or like lavender. Because I did pick up some flowers at Trader Joe's yesterday, but their roses look terrible. So we're going to see, but let me quit talking. Say hey to the vlog. Hey, vlog. We decided we're gonna come to Costco today. He's with me, so we can we can get her done. As long as he's with me, because outside outside of that, I want to be. Let me show y'all the stuff I got for the brunch. So I bought croissants. I bought these. These are they called what did they call them in the thing? Breakfast breakfast buns. Morning buns, but they're actually cronuts. So it's a cross between it's a donut and a croissant. That's what these are. So these look delicious. Too bad I won't know what they taste like though. But and I got some cherry danishes. These look yummy. And I also got some cheese danishes. So I think I'm gonna cut these in fours. Then I also bought pineapples strawberries what else did we buy anyway i bought we bought chickens because we're going to do chicken and waffles bacon eggs the croissants the danishes the cronuts what else did we say honey like some oh fruit potatoes, potatoes going to do yeah, breakfast well, potatoes and so we're also going to do um strawberries grapes and pineapple so i'm so excited i'm gonna start working on my setup maybe tonight or maybe tomorrow but let me go because why are they so loud uh, oh happy saturday so Nothing special. Black top that I got from Target that I showed y'all in the haul. I got on my gold chain, link chain from Express. I have on my Express jeans with splits on the side. And I have these shoes on. Let me show y'all my shoes. These are so cute, y'all. I got these shoes from Target. They're so comfortable. So I just got my sauce body coach bag and I put my contacts in but and this is how we looking today nothing major it's cash real casual so we're headed to um, I gotta do a pickup order from Bath and Body Works because they had all their room sprays for $3.50 today. So I gotta go pick that up. Then I do wanna smell, check out the new scents that everybody's been talking about. I got my eye on like three of them, but I do wanna smell all of them. Um, what else? I have to go get some grapes from the grocery store because we're doing, I sit down. I gotta get some grapes from the store because we're having strawberries, grapes, and pineapples as our fruit selection tomorrow. What else I gotta do? Then I gotta come home and do stuff because we gotta get it together because I don't wanna be prepping any, not really prepping a lot of things tomorrow. So I'm gonna see y'all at the stores. I'm back home, right? And so let me show you, let me show you what I picked up from Bath and Body Works. So I got my scents and my scents pretty much are 
you know, depending on, I'll throw a one seasonal thing in there every so often because I like my house to smell like what you imagine the seasons will smell like, right? But these are my staples. Linen and lavender. Linen, come on focus. Linen and lavender. Laundry day. Y'all know I love laundry day. Um, bergamot and birch. Anything with bergamot in it. I'm a fan. And then I also bought white t-shirt. Nice fresh clean scents for spring this is a new one i picked up freshest brightest bloom i love the bottle but um this is one of their like newest scents this actually smells like a perfume dupe of mark jacobs daisy one of them one of the daisies but i picked up the two two of the luxury scents that they're supposed to have right so i picked up pink obsessed which is supposed to be a dupe for valentino born in roma and I also picked up Petal Parade, which is supposed to be a dupe for Prada. Okay. These are close. It's pretty close. There's a extra hint of something in here. That's not necessarily in here, but that makes it smell like a tad bit sweeter than this, but not that close. They're close. They are close. These here. I was shocked. I was shocked. I was shocked at just how, I was shocked at just how close these are. Like immediately. I didn't know what the different dupes were. A lot of the different dupes. I didn't know. I knew what the one for Valentino was. I knew what the one for um, Flower Bomb and it was another one. Some of them I knew, like the, uh, the Santo. I knew what those were. But immediately when I picked this up, I said, oh, this smells like Prada. And then the lady walked over there and she was like, yep. She said, that's exactly what it's a dupe for. It's a dupe for the Prada perfume. I am shocked. I really, really am. I'm shocked that it's so close. Like this right here is my girl. I love, I love this. But this, the notes here are Neroli petals, orange flower, and white woods. I don't have my phone up here to see what the notes are in this. I'll see if I can put them down across the screen. But y'all, this is very close. Like if you don't wanna spend this, like, Eighteen ninety five compared to okay. Now this is not gonna last long. This is gonna take you all day. It's gonna take you through all day, especially if you layer it correctly. It'll take you all day long. But I don't know how long this will take you. I heard some of the girls say that it would take you. You know, it would last for a little while. But that's just too close, and this is just too good. Like I, I was shocked. Anyway, um, I do, anyway, there are like two more that I want to pick up. I do want to pick up like the Santo. The girls got the vanilla one. I don't like that. Um, it's just, I'm just not a hard vanilla core girl. I told y'all that though. Y'all already know that. Um, like so vanilla-y. That's very vanilla-y. But I do want to pick up like the Palo Santo and then Jasmine like the one that's supposed to be Flower Bomb. It's the purple one. And then I also like the blue one. The blue and the green. Forgot the actual names of them. But the blue and the green, I feel like those would be good gem scents for me. So I would, you know, wear those. Anyway, I'm going to get off this camera because I have to go to bed so I can get up in the morning so I can prep for my guest. And then I'll probably show y'all like some behind the scenes and then, or I'll show y'all something. I don't know what I'm gonna show you because I think I might have to put it in the next vlog. I'll show you the setup, the backdrop that I'm doing for my niece. The brunch might have to be in the next vlog, but either way, I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. Real quick, I, I'm coming in to close out the vlog. So the next vlog that you see on Wednesday, we'll have all the Easter brunch details. It's not gonna be as long as this vlog was, but you'll have it. I'm having some technical difficulties with the footage from the brunch, and I wanna go ahead and get this vlog up to you today because I said I would. So, but before I close it out, I wanted to show you all the robe that I picked up from 
uh, DVF collection at Target. So I have one that I got from when they did the Future Collective, Kalana Brown Barfield. I have that one when it was like, no, I'm sorry, not Kalana. It was Fee Noel. And they did, she had the robe and the matching pants and the bikini top. I got that one because I love, it just gives resort, tropical, I love it. So I wanted to kind of do the same thing with this one, but I'm going to, I didn't get the bathing suit that I showed you all in the last vlog. I'm going to pick one up that's like this green color um, or use the white one that I have for when we are going on a trip. But I ended up getting the extra small, even though the extra, extra small fit, I kind of wanted to have a little bit of room. So I love it. I love the colors in it. Um, typically not a blue girl, but I really liked this because I love green. Also, I have my um, my last DVF set, the sweater and the bottoms. Have them coming in the mail today. The pants came today. The sweater um, top should be here tomorrow, so we're gonna try that on. Hopefully, the small is not too big because it's really stretchy. So hopefully, it's not. And then. I have a couple pieces I wanna show y'all from Express that'll be in Sunday's vlog. So those try-ons will be in Sunday's vlog along with the try-ons try -ons from the pieces that I showed y'all in the last vlog from Target. I wanted to try them on to see how I still feel about them. So we're gonna do that, but that's gonna be it for this particular vlog. Thank y'all so much as always for watching. I really do appreciate you all. Thank you for liking. Thank you for commenting. Thank you for sharing. Thank you for subscribing. We're growing and I'm so, so, so excited. Um, don't forget to like, comment, share. And if you haven't subscribed, go ahead and come on over and subscribe. I will see y'all Wednesday.